Hi, this is John, and we are here at the facilities of Global Transfer Solution, so one of our customers. So, they use the vertical shaker. This is the one that they, sh they use it. So, today they are almost done with the job. And this is the setup that they had. Okay? And they use also the Epson printer. Same thing with the Epson printer. And they use this one. So, they are this, this they prepare to the automatic shaker. See so this one? That's what they're doing. So, this is the conclusion. They use this two Epson printer with automatic shaker with this one too okay and they have that uh, Chinese printer see this one got two head clog so we need to replace the head and with this uh, with this uh, experience it's still the the best experience is still the they prefer to still use the Epson printer because it's still more durable compared to to the Chinese printer. So this is a Chinese design printer. This is fast. Okay, the printer is fast because it's print at 720 dpi. But when one of the head clog like this, uh, you need to replace two heads. Or one head so that's this is the setup that they have and so based on the experience it's still better to use the the Epson printer it's more durable it's more usable and they are very reliable because number one that is an Epson printer you are comparing an Epson printer with a this one with assemble printer but you know if you have a big printing needs faster speed this is a better one but in terms of reliability this is still the better one, okay? This is uh, one of the tes testament that they are using in here. So look at this, the setup that they are doing. You suck all the air out there. There is the fan at the end. That suck the air out. And so this is to, they have the light to know that, you know, the fan is working. So look at this, okay? So this is how it works. So the conclusion is still, the Epson printer is still the best one. The best one, base experience compared to other. So that's why they have two Chinese printer here. Here, one is clogged, and these are the Epson printer that they're using. Now it's not on standby. And there's another printer there too, a Chinese printer that got clogged also. So. They stop using the Epson printer, the, the Chinese printer, and they still go back to the Epson printer because for them, this is still the most reliable printer they can use in their operations. So, this is the lesson, guys. If you are starting a DTA printer, it's not worth to go with Chinese printer. But if you become master already, then you, buy, you pass already the two units or three units of this printer. So, that's the time that you have to go with this uh, Chinese printer. So, but so far, the Epson delivers a job and they've been here in the business already for like four years and they're still using the Epson printer. They don't want to convert to Chinese printer anymore. Okay? Look at this uh, here that's happening. Thank you so much. Have a nice day.